It is 4 a.m. and we are heading to Skardu. It's my first time in Skardu. I'm super excited. So we've come to Islamabad International Airport and we are heading there one hour, the most scenic flight in the world, hopefully, and also one of the more dangerous flights on this trip because we're flying through the mountains and there's no airports. So let's head on, let's get in there, get checked in and head to the beautiful Skardu of Baltistan. I'm also joined with Walid. Are you ready, bro? It's way too early, bro. I'm tired. I'm tired. I need a coffee right now. Get me a coffee. There we go, guys. Pakistan International Airways. The check-in man was an absolute legend and got us both window seats on the right side, which is apparently where you see all the beautiful views. So we're going to be seeing the Himalayas, K2, maybe, and uh, hopefully visibility is good. But yeah, this ride is going to be insane it's going to be some of the best views i've ever seen on a flight i have to say once you get over the waking up early and getting your sleep it's actually really nice because this whole place is empty you get through fairly quickly no queues what? i want this one right here what a banana brownie it's not even healthy none of it's healthy i know then you're supposed to get something more unhealthier <laughs> which one's the most unhealthy probably the donut uh, actually, I all of it. <laughs> all of it. All right, we've come to Bread and Co. to get some coffee. Hello, one coffee, please. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Sub oh. ticket. Good, good, good. Uh, one uh, cappuccino, please. <laughs> could I have one of these right here? The brownie. Out of all of these, put a red velvet or Oreo, and you might do. Look at the double chocolate chip cookie. Mm. No, I'm a brownie. I'm a brownie guy, man. Dude, that brownie doesn't look legit, bro. I know no. what a brownie looks like. Doesn't it? No, I know a good brownie when I see one. That looks like they made that with love and care. Brit, is is brownie good? Yeah. Which is the best one? He's gonna say the he's gonna say the cupcake for the chocolate chip cookie. I love the best. All of them. Yeah. You've tried Which all is of your favorite? Brownie. Oh, see, damn, bro, you you you're missing out. All right. Come over here. What's the damage? Enough, sir? Yeah, enough. 920. 920, alright. Shukriya, bye. Oh, sorry. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, sorry, my fault. Thank you. Have a nice flight. Shukriya. Assalamu alaikum. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Yes, sir. Good. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Okay. Shukriya, bye. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Right, here we go. Oh, yeah, we have the delivered brownie. Thank you, bro. All right, this is a pretty old plane. <laughs> pretty, pretty, pretty dirty plane, but uh, hopefully, we'll get, it, get us there in one piece. I'm also in the escape slide. Bro, we've got the escape slide. So if anything goes wrong, we are we're jumping off first. Also, I haven't told you yet. This is going to be probably the most dangerous flight of your life. I'm not. I'm not kidding, because I was I was researching about it. I don't want to hear it. No, let me just tell you. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> There's no airports from here to Skardu, so we either have to fly back here or there's, we just have to go to Skardu. It is what it is. <laughs> Inshallah. I'm excited. We got perfect seat the, 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 yeah the window is not really clean but hopefully we got some good views i'm also gonna have my brownie right now look at these guys this is gonna get messy <laughs> 5 a.m brownie 6 a.m brownie hits the spot Nice healthy breakfast. This visibility is pretty poor right now. I know. I'm, I'm really hoping for it to get better. <laughs> Otherwise, this video idea has gone out the window. I was like, I thought the perfect idea, the most scenic flight in the world, and it's just going to be clouds. No, it's hard to see because it's so bright. Incredible though. Oh my god, this is absolutely insane. We are so close to these mountains. We're basically flying. This is really scary. There's a lot of turbulence. We're flying through the valley. So we've got mountains 
either side. The sounds are horrible. We're on a really old airplane. How you feeling, bro? I'm freaking out. Oh my god. This is actually really scary for me even. Like, look how close to this mountain we are. This is crazy, there's literally nowhere to land. All right, we are coming into land now. We're literally like landing in a valley. This pilot is pretty skilled, not gonna lie. It's not easy. Here we go, coming into land now. You see the lakes and the trees starting to get greener. And this is the desert also. Saying I've never ever experienced anything like this. It's been <laughs> it hasn't been smooth, but it's been fun. Going coming back will be fun as well. Here we go. Landing now. Ready. Oh, it's literally like desert. Oh my god. It actually is desert. We are literally in the middle of the desert. Oh, have a nice day, thank you so much. Wow. Holy moly. Look at this for an airport. Wow. This is insane. Oh my god. Look at this. You can see the mountains surrounding us with 360 views of the mountains, the snow capped mountains, the beaming sun. The temperature is like frosty, clean air, and uh, this is insane. All right, I've switched into my traditional Hansa hat. I'm so happy to be here. This is a really nice temperature. I've got a jacket on because it's just a tiny bit, just a tiny bit cold. I'd say like maybe 15 to 20, but it's just surreal being in the desert and then having surrounding mountains, the jagged rocks, the snow at the top and nice weather. Last time I came to the north, it was absolutely freezing. So we are in the shoulder season between summer and winter. So it's not too bad, but uh, Wow, I was like actually debating not to, whether to come here because it's just like quite hard to get here and stuff but I'm so glad I came here and uh, I'm so excited to explore Skardu get, we'll get to the hotel, try some local food and uh, meet our tour guide Akram and Pervez I'm so excited to see them, it's been a year since I've seen them everyone here is just like chilling, taking photos I'm in, I'm in people's way, getting in people's way but um, I also just realized I've been backlighted by the sun, so that was probably terrible. What are your first impressions, bro? Breathtaking. It is. Unbelievable. It I is never thought we would land like that. Outstanding. 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 Yeah. Yeah. How are you? Okay, say hello. I'm fine, sir. Somebody is saying TikTok. Abkhaz, eh? Oh, it's beautiful. There is. You live in the most beautiful place in the world. Yes, yes. Where are you from? Main England, sir. England? Yeah. California. You like our see. you like our hats? Yeah, yeah. yeah you? We look local. Yes, yeah. You look Pakistani. Pashtun. Yeah, Pashtun. 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 We are Pashtun. Me yeah. Pakistani here. Yeah. Yeah, G G. Okay. Are you, are you YouTuber? G G. What is uh, good to do in Skardu? What would you recommend? Everything is good in Skardu. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Everything. Yeah. What you. is your job? My job is uh, PI in Bangladesh and then. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. So if our, ba our baggage won't get lost. Yeah. You didn't drop it over the over the mountains. In by a foot and. Oh, here we go. We're getting on the bus. All right. Thank you so much. Thank it you. was nice, nice to meet you, bro. Nice to meet you. Nice thank, you. thank you, bro. There's also like dotted around like army security with uh, big AK-47s to just remind you, a subtle reminder of where we are. This is the entrance to the terminal. This is the airport here. It's a pretty small airport. But uh, I guess you don't need a, a big one and it's got the mountains everywhere. So there's like no security. Is there, any, no, is there no security, like anyone can just come in. There was literally no like uh, immigration. I guess we, it was a domestic flight. So. And we don't need to wait for our bags. No, that's why. We just brought this back here. We're looking for Mr. Posh. Maybe he's out here. Mr. Posh. <laughs> How are you, bro? Good to see you. How are you? Thank you. Good, good. This is uh, Waleed. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice to meet you. How are you doing? You look well. How's the family? I am nice. Everything good? is fine. Good, good. It's been a year. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. This is beautiful. And not so cold as last time. Yeah. Nice and uh, nice temperature. How far is this from Hamza? 
How far is it? It's three and a half Three hours, well it's not too bad. That plane journey was crazy. Yeah. It's so like close to the mountains. Yes. But it was beautiful. I have to say flying has been 10 times better than driving. I'd done the drive before, 18 hours it took me. I think it's important to experience that because it makes you grateful that a lot of people have to go that, do that drive very often. But second time round, I was not driving. We had to fly and I feel fresh. I feel energized so we can make more and better videos for you guys. Um, and actually like for a return flight, Islamabad to Skardu, it was like a hundred dollars. So there and back, which I think is pretty good value for money. So yeah, now we're just cruising along to the hotel, you can see these crazy views either side. It's beautiful. Yeah. Or yak. Oh, no. oh nice. No, it's not a buffalo. <laughs> what is that? I think it's the school. You see the school children. There's actually a lot of schools here waiting for the bus. Wow. Imagine growing up and going to school in this area. Wild. This is crazy. So unique. <laughs> we just got a lone sheep crossing the road. Um, wow. Oh no, we got a couple. The thing that I remember about Hunza last time, we came in the winter and there was no, all the trees were grouped there. There was no, no greenery. This time we got so much more greenery. So it looks so, so much more beautiful. These kids have a long, long walk home. Mm. Like a couple of kilometers. There's no bus. That is, but 